we're thieves, but we help the wrong person steal the wrong thing and unleash the greatest evil the world has ever known. It is once again time for more new movies at home, and today the new Dungeons & Dragons movie gets a release on disc and cheaper digital. Chris Pine and Michelle Rodriguez on a quest in that fantasy world of the legendary game. Hey, better than the last time we tried to make a D&D movie, huh? It's also streaming on Paramount Plus and MGM Plus. There's something out there, something alien. All right, also now on disc and cheaper digital, 65, space pilot Adam Driver versus dinosaurs on a prehistoric Earth. Don't run away now because of me. There are thousands of meetings. I'll find another one. The drama, A Good Person, with Florence Pugh and Morgan Freeman as recovering addicts who share a tragic connection. Nobody here but us pigeons. And inside, thief Willem Dafoe going crazy, trapped in an apartment for weeks. It's also on Peacock. I believe this is a very important historical site. Then some new indie films, The Lost King, Sally Hawkins obsessed with discovering a lost medieval grave. And Spinning Gold, the true story of 70s label Casablanca Records. Jeremy Jordan, Jason Derulo, and Wiz Khalifa among that cast. Get the horses. We don't have any. We'll find three. Then also a bunch of new action flicks. The Warrant, Breaker's Law, a new western with Neil McDonough and Dermot Mulroney. The Siege, bodybuilder Daniel Stison taking on bad guys. Mojave Diamonds, UFC star Donald Cerrone out to rescue a kidnapped family. Fist of the Condor, starring martial artist Marco Zoror. And Assassin, which might just be Bruce Willis's final movie, about mind-implanted drone hitmen. You may have thought it was a game, but it was also a test. Then hey, a bunch of great old movies upgrade to 4K today. The 80s classic, The Last Starfighter. 90s favorites, Thelma and Louise, Wes Craven's The People Under the Stairs, that awful remake of The Haunting, and Stallone's Cliffhanger. And also from the 60s, The Night of the Hunter, with Robert Mitchum and the original Jerry Lewis, Nutty Professor. This is a bachelorette party, you know what that means. We go see naked men. And then we go digital, where straight from theaters, new on premium VOD now is the sequel Book Club, the next chapter. Diane Keaton, Jane Fonda, Candace Bergen, and Mary Steenburgen on a girl's trip to Italy. Also Hypnotic, the twisty thriller from director Robert Rodriguez with cop Ben Affleck up against a psychic criminal. And the new shark movie, The Black Demon, Josh Lucas facing off against a big old Meg. And then on regular VOD, got a Western Oregon Trail about a girl out for revenge against some bloodthirsty bandits. And Monica, trans actress Trace Lizette, caring for her dying mom, Patricia Clarkson. Ah, stop, 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 I'm doing something! Then finally, a little streaming update. Netflix just dropped a new season of the sketch comedy, I Think You Should Leave. Hulu has a new documentary about hip-hop country star Jelly Roll. What if I said that you printed out classified information? And Max has HBO's new movie, Reality, with Euphoria's Sidney Sweeney as a real-life whistleblowing intelligence agent in some hot water. Okay, that does it for now, but we got a big animated Spider-Man sequel hitting theaters as early as Thursday. I'm going to be back with a look at that and more on Friday on the next Director's Chair.